Well, it's NAB 2019 and we are at the Cowex stand. And uh, the man we're talking to today is Dave. Hi, Dave. Hi, nice to see you. And you, um, what are we talking about this year at NAB? Uh, well, the big focus at NAB this year is IP. Um, this is our Apollo console. Uh, it's connected to the new uh, IP core that we've released, which is a native a 67 SIMT2110 uh, core. Um, there's a massive picture of the core here, um, but that gives us some, some information about how the core is connected. Everything's based on IP. It's also a new immersive core for us, so it's uh, 3D audio or Dolby Atmos uh, in the US particularly. Uh, and actually on the core, you're able to run multiple consoles simultaneously. So it kind of kills a few different problems, IP, uh, multi-console cores and immersive audio. And give us some of the other benefits of moving over to IP from traditional methods. Uh, I think that there's a couple of benefits. One is uh, future-proofing your facility. People are looking to put more channels of audio and more channels of video over the same cheap infrastructure. So we all talk about COTS hardware as being the thing to go, commercial off-the-shelf switches. And I think that's, that's a big influence on in how we build systems. So it's that ability to get both audio, video, and data over a common network, common cabling, rather than having all this uh, baseband uh, expensive cabling across the, the infrastructure. So obviously if you've moved into this digital realm and everything's moving around through AS67, surely everything's the same then. Where, where, at which point does the console come into this? Well, the console re really becomes the operator's tool, so um, you're absolutely right. I think once everything moves to IP, there are always going to be some things like microphone ports, speaker outputs that are not IP based. But I think one, once everything's in an IP uh, backbone, really the operator's job is about using the surface and, and the same technology that we've had on our products to actually do mixing, whether it's immersive mixing or 5.1 mixing, is still in play. Uh, and this new core is our Bluefin 3 processing end, so it's the next generation of our Bluefin technology for audio processing, and that's an even bigger mixing console than we've done in the past with the existing technology. So you can have the IP technology in the background, but the, what we all know and love from Calrex still on the console. Yeah, absolutely, when, and we don't want we want the operators to have the same tools they've always had, um, the same facilities they've always had. And actual fact, we don't really want the operators to worry too much about the IP network because we're taking that workload off them by building it around an IP infrastructure. Brilliant. Well, this is the first time we've heard about this. Is this uh, shipping now? Um, it should start shipping around late summer. That's yeah. the, the sort of target frame for it. But uh, we are. It is passing audio. It's dem demonstrable at the show. So do come along and have a look at it. Fantastic. So obviously you're here at NAB. If people weren't able to come and have a play here, is there a website they can go to to find out more information? Yeah, it's uh, carac.com. Nice and simple. Dave, thank you very much. Well, there you go. You want to find out more about the amazing IP technology from Carac, go and check out their website. And for more from us here at NAB 2019, don't forget to look at kitplus.com.